Hello, hello. So it's the end of week three where we get to bring it all together. And this really is you time with bells on. And you know what to do. It's time to check in and really figure out or get a sense of what it is that has resonated for you this week in terms of what we've covered, because we've covered a fair bit of ground. You know, we talked about sparking our furnace with the right kind of exercise that's actually going to work for us. We've talked about posture, how that, that can actually affect all of the systems in our body. We talked about that general awareness on the way that our bodies are actually built to move and a way to act, ways to actually fit that in to our lives. So I want you to grab a, grab a pen, paper, your phone right now and diarize that, schedule it in because when it's in our diaries, it is real. And that might be figuring out the time, you know, putting half an hour aside to find where you're gonna be able to track down that stationary bike that's gonna make exercising a lot more of a, a straightforward thing to fit into your life. And yeah, I would, you know, I'd love to hear from you. So just take a second now and drop me a line or share on Facebook what has been your aha this week. What, has, how, what you're going to be doing for yourself to put you on the map. Because remember, this is all about you, basically. And what this does is it means that we're may, way more likely to actually do it when we, when we declare it, when we say it out loud to other people. So yeah, keep your eyes peeled as we gallop into, or sedately go, gra graciously glide into week four of our 28 days together for your opportunity to actually be able to have a heads up and get your application in for the Vibrant Living program, which is coming very soon. So yeah, I'm super excited about that. Can't wait to share it with you. Anyway, I promised I wouldn't yet. So have a fabulous one, and I look forward to seeing you next week.